aka the gamer girl here and I wanted to talk about the video games that I'm playing currently so let's take a look so everybody I've been diving into five different worlds of beautiful and like gory and battle royales and all that jazz so I wanted to tell you what I've been currently playing to like give you an insight on what I've been doing so the first one is Ori and the Blind Forest. I have been playing this on my PC. Thankfully, the, the, the graphics are just low enough to where I can play on an iCore 3. And the one thing is, is I love about this is it's a beautiful story about a little light creature that is going through the world trying to rejuvenate all the local areas to bring back sustenance to the world so that everybody is good and golden and it's so cute i love the story in the beginning and then how it just keeps going and it gives you that disney effect where somebody passes away right away and then you have to like venture forth on your own and stuff like that so it's a great little game that i recommend and i know that the second one's coming out so i recommend everybody play this one first so you know what's going on and this the fighting style and the mechanics and the little lights that help you throughout the world so this is a good one right here so the second game that i'm currently playing is fortnite <laughs> yeah i'm when i mentioned battle royale everybody was automatically probably thinking of fortnite but yeah so i've been currently playing fortnite um i will admit season eight i'm not really fond of I particularly don't like the sounds and everything that's changing and stuff like that and how it's changing to be more like Apex Legends and stuff like that but I really dug season 7 although a lot of people hated season 7 I really liked it I liked the two events that I was able to make which was the first time I was able to make two events back to back and they were awesome to see I missed like the earthquakes and stuff like that but they didn't look epic at all which is why pun intended I didn't really wasn't too sad about it but I I have beaten all the challenges for season seven and was really engulfed in it and tweeted about it a lot to the the developers and I was like yeah you need to fix this guys and sadly they didn't fix that one so hopefully um they listened to us and realized that we don't like all the changes we want you to fix what you already have broken and I already see a bunch of glitches and a whole bunch of, like, exploits that you can use. And I'm like, ah. So, we'll see what happens in the next season. And the next game that I am playing right now is Pirates of the Dark Water, the Genesis version. Um, this one is a platformer, which is really, really difficult in certain areas and takes a lot of memorization. And right now, the only reason why I haven't beaten it is because of the last level. The last level is kicking my butt, guys. It is basically, uh, I'm not going to spoil it for a lot of people who haven't played it yet, but it's a lot of jumping onto platforms and the platforms move and you have to memorize how they move and stuff like that. And you have a bunch of like creature things. I'm, I'm just like, they are all over the place. And if you take another way, you have really hard platforms and mm, I just don't know what to do with it. So... It's, it's kicking my butt, but I have made it to the last level, and I am struggling with that one. If if I can get it, I will be done, and I'll see the ending. And if that does happen, I will try to record the ending, because I'll probably be super pumped, but <laughs> we'll go from there. So the next game that I'm currently playing is Dark Angel. I've been bouncing back and forth from game to game, and this one, I'm really liking it so far a lot of people said it's hard and yeah i i got you i will agree like there's certain points where you're like huh so this one i i've been waiting for to play and i'm liking how they're doing the story it's it's basically the story of the tv show if you haven't played the like the game or heard of the tv show you're gonna be in lost in the dark so i would say look it up to like check it out but the gist of it is is it's you know jessica alba but not Jessica Alba. <laughs> I don't think she actually voiced the game. I, I can't tell, really. But I'm liking the story. It's a little bit like Tomb Raider, 
but with a little bit of Metal Gear Solid is what I'm kind of getting my vibe from, and I'm hoping to beat this game soon, but it's, there's some parts that are, like, taking me for a loop, so we'll see what happens there. And guys, the last game that I'm currently playing is Hitman 2. I know I was being overdramatic, but hey, you gotta do it. S ASMR, you know what I'm saying? I gotta do it like that. <laughs> but yeah, so I've been currently playing Hitman 2 right now. And the the one thing I love about Hitman and Hitman 2 and all that is there's so many ways to do each level. The replayability is what I love. Like, I can go back to any levels at any point and go through and try a different way to beat the person or stop the person or kill the person. And the one thing is, is there's so many ways to be, you can be right there directly in front of the person and shoot them and kill them, or you can go invertly and find like some like device and like shock them or something like that. And that's what I love about Hitman games is you can be really enthralled in the game and I've sometimes waited like a half an hour to kill somebody because the scenario involves you making sure that they make their way down to a certain area and then you have to make sure that everything's lined up before you can do it and then from there they they have a pattern and if you miss that pattern they'll go to do something else and then there's like little sneaky like if you overhear somebody you could you could maybe possibly do it but it's a timed event and if you don't make it in that time then it's screwed but I love this game and, and I recommend anybody picking up Hitman 2. It's a lot more in-depth and open world and there's a lot more stuff that you could actually do besides the first one. And let me just say, you can slap people with a fish. Doesn't that incite you guys? Come on now. <laughs> okay guys, that is currently what I am playing right now. Let me know in the comments below, what are you currently playing? What are your games that you're all into? Thank you guys for watching. If you're new, please subscribe. And as always, keep on gaming, everybody. Catch you later.